was a massacre in church that got certain forces moving. Many towns are now at least superficially improving, such as in Virginia, where a statue of General Lee stands as a reminder of the days of slavery. In the city center, an indelible mark, in the spot that's been renamed Emancipation Park, slated for removal when a judge intervened, which might the moment that most fully set the scene for 19 injured, one killed, today in Charlottesville. With their men in the White House, members of the right marched through the university, torches alight, chanting against immigrants, Africans, and Jews, but it's not the flying bottles that put the so much as the bigot in the car, revving his engine loud, speeding forward and then back, running down the crowd, using the same tactic promoted by Islamic State. Maybe he was even shouting, God is great. Nineteen injured, one killed, today in Charlottesville. Now their descendants, who still remain, are being forced to leave by gentrification, just like poor white folks all across the nation. And with the presidential tweets and xenophobic rants, it's just a matter of time before some pawn takes the chance to plow into a march with half a ton of steel. This is not fake news, it's real. Nineteen injured, one killed, today in Charlottesville. Nineteen injured, one killed, 